hi. I was about to say good morning. It's definitely not the morning anymore. Um, the time is half nine at night and I'm gonna be doing an all nighter. Yeah, I'm gonna do an all-nighter tonight. I just thought it'd be really fun. We can have a great time together to do so many fun things. And apparently it takes three days to recover from pulling an all-nighter, so that's gonna be fun too. Okay, colour difference. Basically, I've got a uni assignment due tomorrow. And have I done it? No. Is it gonna take me all night? Probably. So, <laughs> this isn't gonna be like a really fun, like, woohoo, scurly pumper night all-nighter, let's eat cookies and drink hot chocolate. It's more of a like, Gemma, you're an idiot. Why have you left your essay this long? I've never really done all, well actually I have done an all-nighter before, but it wasn't like, I wasn't by myself and it wasn't to work. So that kind of changes it a little bit. Anyway, so it's half past nine. I thought I'd start it now. I don't know what point of the day you're meant to start an all-nighter and at what point does it count that I've done it? You know? <laughs> yeah so i'm gonna i guess start writing my essay i'm gonna start working i do want to go to the shops though before they shut what time does the shop shut 11 so i'm gonna do some work for like probably 45 minutes in this 10 minute clip i say i'm gonna do some work now about 15 times if i just started the work instead of saying it i probably would have finished the essay I annoy myself so much. Um, I've got a lot of reading to do to actually try and even like understand what I'm writing in this essay. So I might read through the articles now and then go to the shop. Surely I'm gonna get hungry, right? If I stay up the whole night, do I need to have double the amount of meals? Anyways, I'm really, this is not good use of time. So I'm gonna do some work for like 45 minutes. Then I'm gonna go to the shop. So should we do a time lapse of me working? It's a good idea. So then, do you know what? can't bloody cheat then, then i have to be held accountable you know just like a stupid amount of food i'm not gonna lie i don't know how i spent so much money got some fruits to keep me healthy cookies chocolate i got a few drinks i got a red bull but i was gonna get id do you still have to be 16 to buy a red bull or do i just look over 16 now i am 20 years old so we, we would hope so i got a monster this flavor is mango loco never had a monster in my life so this will be interesting why do you have to buy them in such big things LucasAid Sport. I haven't had one of these in years. Oh. We used to have them every single week at dance because they used to sell these at my dance school. Oh my god. Brings back so many memories. Anyways, let's drive home because... Hello capital. I'm gonna drive home and get back to work. Okay, I'm back. My room looks like an absolute tip behind me, but um, go and ignore it. I thought I'd try these energy drinks. You know why I got you a treat too? Do you want one? Here, look. Oh, I just punched you in the face. I'm so sorry. It smells like a Jager bomb. <coughs> I feel like I'm just doing a Jager bomb. It's not horrendous, but I don't really like fizzy drinks, so I don't think this is ever going to work. Let's try the monster. Size of my head. <gasps> Pretty nice. Wow. I actually really like that. It's probably really horrendous for you, but just in case the RSPCA are watching, she's not having any Red Bull because she's not 16 yet, are you? Let's do some more words, because that is actually why we're here today. Say hi! Hi! As always, I drag Sophie into my work. She's actually done way more than me. She's actually written too many words, which is a trouble I'm not having. So I thought I'd just have a mini roll instead. Time check, by the way. It's currently half past midnight. What time do you think counts 
I was like, I've done an all nighter. Yeah, I would say that's six. Six. Hey, do you want an update? Because it's 2 a.m. I'm eating grapes. I'm. <laughs> I'm so tired. My mouth doesn't even want to chew properly. I'm like forcing it to move to eat this grape. Oh, I think that's a sign I need a nose job. Life's not fair. So I'd give you an update. Sophie's gone to sleep because she's finished. Traitor. I don't think I can read another article about the Hawthorne studies. Oh, if you're interested, the title of my essay is Organisation Studies is a Science. To what extent do you agree with this statement? My answer is, I don't care. <laughs> I'm not convinced that any of what I'm writing is making sense, but I am like halfway through. A lot of it is just waffle though. Quality, quantity, I think I've got neither. But as long as I get it handed, it, handed it in, as long as I get it handed in, as long as I get it handed in before 12 o'clock tomorrow. I don't care. So it's two o'clock, so that means I've got three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Ten hours. Obviously I'm gonna finish it in ten hours. <laughs> I'm so hungry. Why does it feel like the morning? I feel like I just need to like shock my brain into work mode also i do have lessons tomorrow in the morning well and all day so it's gonna be really cool i'm living my life as if this is the only thing i've got to do whereas you know yeah i'm a busy lady i'm a very busy lady <laughs> i can't move my legs they've gone dead right do you know what focus Gemma. Okay, I'm gonna keep writing. Send help, I'm not doing well. Oh hey, so the current time is 5.20. You may be wondering what I've been doing for the last two hours. And the answer is, I decided to watch a movie. <laughs> um, basically I just, my brain wasn't computing the work anymore. I couldn't do it, I had, it just wasn't working. So I was like, you've got long enough. You can watch a movie. It's definitely just made me tired, huh? I know. I know it's this. I, know. I feel drunk. I watched The Age of Adeline, if you're interested. Basically, all that happens is she gets in a car crash, she stops getting old. She gets in another car crash, she starts getting old again. So really, I could have slept for like half the movie and I would have known what was going on. Maybe I did sleep. I really can't remember. I've watched the movie before, so... <coughs> I really want to go to sleep. I need to finish my essay. Yeah, at seven o'clock, I'm gonna submit this essay. Oh my god. Let me live, please. I need to take my makeup off. Oh, hey. I'm gonna write this essay now. I've been saying that for the last 12 hours. Yes, I'm in the dark. My eyes are tired of the light you know like your eyes are only meant to do 12 hours of light maybe like 14 hours of light a day I might have done like I see many now but I finished oh, oh my god I'm literally submitting it right now I can't remember what I meant to call it okay I just like everyone to watch this happen now we have to check. Yeah, got my email. I'm gonna take my makeup off. I'm gonna go. Um, I'm gonna go downstairs and make some breakfast because I'm so hungry. Right, let's go downstairs and try not wake my entire family up. Oh, time check. Hello. Six fifty-five. Disgusting. Hey, welcome to my kitchen. Cook for me bacon quickly, please. This angle is just lovely, but I've decided to bring my food upstairs because I've already made 
And off of a bracket downstairs. It's currently 7.25. I'm gonna eat this and go to bed. So, uh, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. 10 out of 10 would not recommend. So just, you know, if you're gonna start an essay or an assignment or anything, do it like at least two days before. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you're new. And I will see you guys next week with another video. Bye.